basically I'm here to protest the fact that uh, Macron hasn't respected the, the result of the, of the election. Uh, well, I'm here because definitely there was a vote, like uh, two months ago, and the president didn't didn't think it was a good idea to listen to the voice of the people. <laughs> now he just like deciding on his own, like, okay, I want to do that and just not listen to the people. He's just doing what he wants and not hearing anything from people. There was uh, elections um, in France and um, uh, people had uh, voted for uh, a left, uh, left, yeah, left, left, yeah, left side and um, uh, Macron, uh, the president, didn't um, uh, listen to uh, the people. So now we're here to uh, defend democracy. I'm here today to think with all the others, think over new ways of fighting. Uh, I'm here personally because I believe that the Fifth Republic and Macron are outdated. We are citizens and we have to build that this citizen, citizenship all over again from maybe zero but not zero. doesn't want um, his reforms um, overthrown, I would say. He, he knows that uh, most of his uh, politics are not well liked in general by the public and he knows that the left party has uh, campaigned on the general idea of reversing everything he did. That he doesn't want a, a government that uh, uh, implements uh, left politics uh, because it will go against his uh, uh, political legacy and uh, he has this massive ego. This is the result of insincerity. Like you want something fair or something like... Um, that represents our rights, and that's not what Macron gives us. It's been a long time since Macron has stopped listening to what the people want to do. Every time there's a protest in France, he doesn't do anything, he just waits it out until the protest fades out and he can do his own thing. And this time, we didn't just make a protest, we, vote. we did a vote for him to take an action and to respect our left-wing opinions, and he just did not. So. He starts, he starts here and I, no one knows where, where it will end since the truth don't work and the vote don't work either. So nobody really knows what he can do more to hurt the democracy in France. Actually, I think that the way out is really to make another constitution um, because in this constitution we cannot, uh, we are not heard. When we vote, uh, when the people vote, our, our votes are not taken uh, seriously. Yeah, taken seriously, and we are not heard. Even if, even if we, we there, there are strikes like every week for Palestine. Nothing has been done, and Macron has been uh, really vocal about not really caring about the Palestine situation. Uh, we have seen a, a big wave, in fact, to the uh, Rassemblement National, in fact, already before Macron came uh, to the power, he became president. But since he is president, it has grown by three times, you know? And in fact, the real question is, as now is just having a prime minister that is really getting close to uh, also to the Assemblée Nationale. When the extreme right comes to power, the first thing they will do is like to forbid difference, forbid uh, get rid of different ways of thinking, um, make things harder for everyone who thinks different than, than them, you know. I think 
that the basis is to address the economic problems of the people. You know, uh, of course, I'm for the respect for the different identities. Me being a migrant, I'm a person of color, maybe. Uh, I agree that we need to protect the different kind of people and thinkings and sexual orientation, everything, you know. But right now, I think that the capitalism has made so much harm that the common people in the countryside and the common people who is not academic prepared, they don't understand the discourse of defending the different identities. So now I think the left has to focus in the economic struggle above all, you know. For me, if we don't address this struggle against the capitalism, we are going to lose this battle.